James does it in the day I the Hone have sent me their perfect mash the buttery kind But what I want to know is does it fry? <laughs> so in today's episode we have got Hunters Hey this, look at this mate, look at this mate I the Hone have sent us Hunters of Mash mate I've been eating mash for the last six weeks of my life And I like it mate Now straight away the first thing you're going to think is Mash in a packet? Nah, you can't do that. Trust me, right? I was a non-believer before this. You might just think, because they've sent us hearts of mash, that I'm just gonna go, I love this mash, it's so good. No joke, no word of a lie. Daniel, I gave one to Daniel before telling you. Daniel, mate, you tried it. What did you think when you actually made it the wee pot one? Re surprisingly really good. It like is mash. genuinely mental. I was in a Zoom meeting for work and I'm sitting there with a pot of mash and somebody put in the chat, who is that eating mash? <laughs> Not just eating mash, who's that eating mash for breakfast? Mate, I eat when I'm hungry, right? Need a bowl. So it says add 475 ml of boiling water. Alright, so you put the water in first. Right, cool, I can do that, I can do that. Stir in packet using a fork to evenly wet all potatoes. Let the potatoes sit for a minute. Fluff up with a fork and enjoy. Wait, so what's inside it? Dried mashed potatoes with butter flavour. But it's what? real tatties, real potatoes. And it's just mashed. It's no, you're, he doesn't quite get the concept. I don't know. He doesn't get Can it. Can you explain it to me? You, you don't need to explain, you'll see it. Right, so it says 475. Put the water in first, then the mash. Which is interesting. It's interesting. Yeah, it's a bit different. Usually it's the other way about, isn't it? Right, we'll go a 475 mils. Let's <laughs> pour it in this tiny wee bowl. Oh wow, that's just perfect. Oh, it's too small. <laughs> and then we open up our mash, right? Here we go. Right, Omar, this is that, this. that's what it looks like before, right? Because you need to see it before it does its magic, right? That's what it looks like pre doneness, right? It just looks like kind of powder, oh. right? I still don't get how this turns into potato. Mate, it doesn't make any sense. I, really I can't understand it. Right, here we go. I'm not gonna lie, I think our bowl was maybe a bit. Small, but it's fine. It's fine. Now watch yeah, this. Watch this, cooked. right? So you evenly wet everything. Look at this. Look. Wow, dude. Look. That, oh my god. Mate, mate, look. What the hell? It's already turning. It is <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that was legit like five seconds or something. It's one minute, so let's let's give it a one minute. One minute of time. Okay, so we got yeah, sweet, perfect. Okay. Then you can just leave it. Just let it sit. Yeah. It's honestly mental how quickly it does it. All right, we'll come back in one minute. Mate. It's been a minute. Mate, that's <laughs> honestly, what? <laughs> no, this, I'm no hyping it up just because I said is it for nothing. This is mental. I don't, I still don't understand in my brain how this works. That's actually really cool, I'm not that gonna lie. Good as well. Yeah, this smell nice. I have been thinking for honestly about three weeks on how we're going to deep fry it. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick the mash up, right, when it kind of cools down a wee bit. We're going to bore it, right, we're going to bore the mash. We're going to bore it. See that bore action? Yeah. And then we're going to whack it into the old freezer for about an hour, an hour and a half maybe. Get it nice and kind of solid, right, and then at that point it's getting whacked into that fryer. We are going to have these wee Idaho and Perfect Mash balls, mate. Can't wait. So now it's cooled down a bit so that we can make that into wee balls. Oh, you're so good at that. Do I know why? Why? Make meatballs, mate. Oh, nice. <laughs> you're so proud of like your ball skills. <laughs> right, so now set the balls in like that. And then we chuck it in the freezer. We'll see you in two hours. Whoa! It's been two hours. Oh mate. I can hear that. <laughs> mate, look at that. Whoa. Oh. Thank God that didn't break. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the bottom is a wee bit still quite soft, but the, everything fine. else is solid, man. Solid. Right, cool. Let's get this in the fryer. Let's see if this works. Right, look at this. I had a whole perfect mash in my <laughs> Daz's perfect batter. Oh. Oh my god, I, th I thought you do that in the oil. Imagine. <laughs> 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 I reckon we could put it just out in the basket. I think it'll work. Yeah. No, it won't. Ready? Ready? The second one. In. Oh my god, you surprised me. Oh, I missed that. Oh yes. Dude, that is so perfect. 
Oh, and right, there go, you go. 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 Throw it in, throw it in. Two go, two go, baby. Two go. Quite heavy. Yeah. They're like proper stuck to the bottom. Oh, the browning. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. See that? See oh, it? yeah. Yeah, this looks nice, by the way. This may actually work. That one's floating. This one, isn't it? Yeah, I'm going to wait until that one floats. Then take them out. Oh, wow, that looks awesome. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, hang on. I'm going to try to flip that. So, but, yeah. Aye. Uh, slight issue. I think I know what's happened with that one. Okay. Oh! It's off there, look. Okay, cool, cool. <laughs> <Sweet>. <laughs> nice. How did that happen? What the heck? <laughs> what? This one's worked perfect. That one's fine. Okay, cool. <laughs> this one, not gonna lie. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> Alright, cool. I'm so glad we've done two. Yeah. yeah. Let's just. Let's just. Let's, 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 no, take the shell, take the shell. Yeah, take the shell. You can take eat the shell and show them. So in this episode we have got the Idaho and Buttery Perfect Mash and then we've got an empty shell of what used to be sitting next to it. Let's get right about it. So the actual ball itself, oh my god it's so crispy, look at that, look, let's see that tap. Someone's knocking at the door, someone's making your mash, look at that man. The actual mash inside, do you know what, the, ma the actual mash itself I'm a wee bit scared for because it does look a tad oily in there. But that might just be the outside layer because this has been, I don't know, it must have been a bit where the batter's just kind of slid off. That, oh my days man, look at it. Look at it. The shell. The shell. Look at the shell man, the shell looks mental. Should we see what the crunch sounds like by just breaking it? Oh, go on then. You want to take me, you want me to bite it? Yeah, do you know what? I'll do it. Also, big thanks to the Mad Lad. <laughs> oh! 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 <laughs> big thanks to Idaho for sending us their buttery perfect mash. I was going to catch in my horn, but this is even better. Look at that. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. That sounds amazing. Oh my god, man. Oh, mate. Hmm. So my first thought was that the oil was going to be all inside. It's no. The outer layer is a tad wet, but I'm guessing that's because of the batter and the oil is all mixed together. But it's fine, it's no an issue. It doesn't affect the taste. If anything, it just affects the consistency of it. Oh it's my like, god, man. It's that perfect mix of wetness and crunchiness. Mm, mm. The outer layer is a crisp to it. The inside, nice and soft. It is actual decent, like it's nice, and it does taste buttery. <laughs> it's, it's not just a, a marketing like lie on the front. It genuinely tastes buttery. <laughs> I'm annoyed, but do you want me to tell you why? That we don't have two. That we don't have two. <laughs> I'm so annoyed that this didn't work. Wait. <gasps> I don't know what to say. There. Aye. Yeah, dude. <laughs> oh. Double coating. Can you squeeze it? It's a little bowl. Yeah. Oh it's a little bowl. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> oh, right. Right. See if you're deep frying that in your house, right? I swear to god, just attempt to get a crispy bowl, because that adds so much to it. It adds so many more textures to it, that is mental. It was just a nice, big, buttery, perfectly mashed. See what I've done? Because it's called this is per perfect mash. Right, oh, back to you. Just, but mate, just, but do you know? See, just pure buttery mash, mate. Oh, the buttery mash, nice and soft to compact. The crispy outer shell. Oh my days! Do you know what it was? It's perfectly splendid, mate. It's perfectly splendid. Idaho and buttery perfect mash. Does it fry? Oh. <laughs> Idaho. Here we go. I caught it this time. The mash. Genuinely. Cheers, Idaho, for sending us it out because it was, it was perfect. It's the name suggests. Would you want to see me deep fry next? How would you let me know? Do in the comments below. Why do you always hit me? <laughs> <laughs>